This short video is about how the Lacoste logo came into existence and how it emerged into the world of fashion globally. Did you know the first ever polo shirt originated in India 1859? These were used by polo players. During the 1920s the polo shirts became popular in tennis and golf. This polo shirt is a Lacoste original classic shirt. In 1929, the polo shirt with a top row of buttons and a collar was first made for tennis players in France. René Lacoste founded the company in 1933. Tennis players used to wear sweaters and because it was thicker in material players would feel too hot wearing them. The polo shirt was the better choice as it was lighter, breathable and players felt comfortable in them. Meet the man who founded the Lacoste brand. René Lacoste, born in Paris, France 2nd of July 1904. He was a French tennis player and world tennis champion during 1923-1927. His nickname was the Crocodile because of the way he played against his opponents. You might be wondering, why the Lacoste logo is a crocodile. This is how it all began. Before watching further, please subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon for updates. In 1923, René saw a crocodile-sized suitcase in a window display outside a store. He set his heart on that suitcase and he was thinking about that suitcase till night. During the Davis Cup match in Boston, he made a bet with the captain, if he won the match, they would buy that crocodile suitcase for him from that store. When the match happened, René unfortunately lost the match and was given the nickname, The Crocodile. The press and media continued to refer to René as The Crocodile. René had a rematch the following year and won the match and was gifted a crocodile suitcase by an artist Robert George who designed a crocodile logo on a blazer for René. Before his brand was launched, René used to wear a white blazer with a crocodile embroidered. When the Lacoste clothing brand came, he used the crocodile logo as his iconic symbol. The logo came into existence in 1927. René first wore the lightweight collar polo shirt to the courts of tennis games in 1933, sparking a wave and a revolution. This was his trademark to his brand the cotton fabric polo shirt. With over 90 years of recognition, the Crocodile logo is a work of art designed by Robert George. René Lacoste rocked the world of tennis with his incredible skills. Today the Lacoste brand has become a global sensation. It's known not only for its sportswear but also for its upscale fashion lines. Not only does Lacoste offer short sleeves and polo shirts but, it has expanded a wide range of products, including clothing, footwear, accessories and even fragrances. Lacoste introduced its fragrances during the mid-1960s when it created its first eau de toilette. As years went by, the brand expanded its range of fragrances in the market and became popular with its fans men and women. Lacoste net revenue was estimated at $2.5 billion in 2022 and the French company is worth $10.5 billion along with other fashion competitors brands like Topshop, G-Star and Aldo. Today, Lacoste is owned by a Swiss company based in Geneva Mouse Frayer SA since 2012. Mouse Frayer SA has been in the fashion business since 1902. The Lacoste brand is created primarily for sportswear, however is known for its quality and craftsmanship, part of the reason why it has become the brand it is today and will continue with people of all different ages, sizes and genders wearing their iconic polo shirts, highlighting that the brand caters for anyone. We hope you enjoyed watching this video today. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Hope to see you in the next video.